Well, I'm coming over to pick up Johnny for his birthday. Boy, the smoke over here is pretty bad. I don't know, it's kind of hard to breathe. I'm gonna have to put my mask on. He's at the foot doctor this morning. I don't know if he's home or not yet. We'll, we'll see. No, he's still at the foot doctor, so. Well, he's got some cans he wants me to load up, so I'll do that. Well, here comes the little birthday boy now. That was a pretty fast doctor's appointment, so. Good, we'll get an early start back. <coughs> Let's see how he backs up. He backs up pretty good, huh? Yeah. Yeah, he, he even looks back. Cool. Got some nice oak trees around here. That's a real nice one there. Here comes a little birthday boy. Had to go to the foot doctor. Had to be there at 8.30 this morning. Well, how was it, John? Not too bad? It's open. Yeah. All right, well, let's load up and head out. Look at all them apples we got, thanks to the mullikins. Nana's making, she's going to try her hand at applesauce. And then tomorrow she's going to make a a birthday pie, an, a, an apple birthday pie for the little birthday boy. How's that sound, John? Tomorrow she'll make a an apple pie for you. Here. Sugar-free ice cream, yeah. All right. The pie is not sugar free, right? No. All right. Yeah, once in a while is okay. Well, we're off on our birthday journey. Usually we go somewhere for Johnny's birthday, like Lake Tahoe, Arizona, somewhere, Yosemite. Uh, this, this year we're going to Cambria. <laughs> yeah, just because everybody don't feel too good this year. I certainly don't. Johnny can hardly walk. Nana's in good shape though. And they fall. Yeah, until you fall. <laughs> what was that for? Until you fall. She, oh, she fall. fell and hurt her knee. So. You did fall. You did All right, came rebound. Well, we made it to the cemetery. Hope the gate's open. Well, we can. There it is. It's open. Yeah, we'll stop in and say hi. It's been a little while since we've been here, huh, John? When was the last time you were here? I can't remember. It's probably been about a year, huh, now? It's two years, Been that long? I'm not sure. I like that. Yeah, we'll see. Well, everything looks pretty good. Somebody's been putting some shells there. <coughs> looks very nice. There's John coming over to say hi. Look at these shells here, John. Somebody's been putting them there. Yeah, yeah this one. We should have brought the rake. Oh, well. These guys will clean it up. There's Dad, David, and Donald. Pretty place here, you know. Yeah, good. Do what? Yeah, it's looking good. That's held up real good. Yeah. What's a green branch, huh? Yeah, just squirrels probably knocked it down. 
It's always nice coming up here, nice and peaceful. And usually nobody around sometimes. A lot of people we know is here. Yeah, Louise, dis the Nana disinfected the gravestones here. Looks like the paint's coming off of Louise's. I'm gonna have to repaint it. Yeah, holding up pretty good. Well, looks like a doe there, having a little breakfast. Back up a little, Nana. Yeah. It doesn't look like there's much there to eat, but seems happy. Yeah. All right. Let's take a ride down the Moonstone. Now well, we're coming around the corner where our Mulligan's old place is doing. Boy, they're getting a facelift there. It looks like they're adding on. They got a retaining wall back there, getting a new roof. Wow. Yeah, that's nice. Well, we made it to Moonstone. There's a the birthday boy. I guess he's not getting out. See, there's a party boat over there fishing. I guess he must be out of Morro Bay. I don't think anything goes out of San Simeon anymore. Not too many people here. Kind of nice. It's kind of cold, that's why. Well, I'm gonna go use the bathroom. Well, we'll take a ride to Leffingwell and see if old Howard's down there fishing. Uh, I think the tide's coming in, he might be. Well, we're at Leffingwell. I don't see anybody fishing down there. You can go straight, go across the bridge. See Howard here anywhere? Turn left, right on the other side of the bridge, now. Yeah. Well, I don't see him. Cold out there. Well, I guess we'll head on back here pretty quick. Too cold to get out and do too much. Well, Johnny wants to go by the old house, so... Looks like they kind of added on to it a little bit, huh? Yeah, they sure did. Yeah, it's a lot bigger than it used to be. Looks nice. And we want to go to the... neighbors now, huh? Yeah, the neighbors right next to it, huh? Go left now. People everywhere, God, man. We just don't know how lucky we were living here back then. I'm quite grateful for. There's not much work. We've got Not much work up here. You always have to travel too. All right, let's head home. Head home. We've seen enough. That's enough Cambria for another year. Nana made a mullican apple birthday pie for Johnny on his birthday. And he's having his birthday breakfast over there. Happy birthday, John. 63 today. He's having a, a nice birthday breakfast. We'll have uh, Mexican food later on. All right, well, we'll open your presents and give, give Daryl a call today, and have a nice day. Well, Nana's going to go over to the Mexican restaurant and get our birthday lunch. Well, he's going to have Johnny, he's going to have a Mexican food for his 63rd birthday. Mm -hmm. Huh. Yep. All right, here we go with the birthday party. <coughs> No candle. No candle. Johnny, pie and ice cream for his 63rd birthday. Where's his presents at? 
Well, let's, uh, let's open them up now, John. Oh, wait, my cake was ice cream. Oh, are you going to eat your ice cream first? Okay. All right, then we'll open presents in a little while. All right. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear John. Happy birthday to you. 63. Hope there's 63 more. All right. <laughs> All right. Well, the birthday boy had second helping of pie and ice cream. Now he's going to open his presents up. I think he knows what that is. Nana got that as a present. She passed it on to you. We recycle around here. She'd never use it. It's a, that fan you plug into your USB and it'll cool you down, like when you're on your laptop or something, you know? Oh. It's just a fan. Will the lights go on and stop? I don't know. I have to check it out. All right, keep opening. Thank you. You're welcome. I was wondering if the, <coughs> when the lights go on in the summertime, it gets kind of warm. Oh yeah, so you can you can use that to cool you down. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. That's outside. Is that, that from Madigan? I think it is from Daryl and his family. What's it say? This is my name. Oh. No, I mean the card. What's it say? Let's see, I can't Johnny. see it. Did Johnny have a very happy birthday, the Mullicans? Very nice. Mm -hmm. Very nice of them to do that. You know? I didn't really have to do that. Oh, I know, but they they known you all your life, just about, John. Yeah. yeah. What is it? Oh, wow. Hold it up here. Let's get a picture of it. Oh, very nice. Mm -hmm. We know you like that. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Very nice of them to do that. Mm -hmm. Hand painted. Hand painted. I'll be darned. That's beautiful. Is that a picture? Yeah, well, you got to open it up. Like it's from Nana. I don't know what you What do you think? Yeah. Have to make some more room, huh? Mm -hmm. She made that. Amazing, huh? Yeah, she made that. How she does those there? Hold it up so we can see. Oh yeah, very very nice. It took her hours and hours to do that. Mm. Yeah, it's the show. He, he, you know how to do it. Yeah. Thanks, I work on. Well, that's about the best you're going to get this year. Maybe next year, if we're all better, we'll go somewhere. But this is the best you're going to get, all right? Happy birthday, John. Thank you, thank you guys so much. All right. See you next year.